Three. Okay. Yeah. Now the next thing to do here is uh, the boiling um, meat here. You add a little bit of pepper to it. Mm -hmm. It doesn't have to be this sequence, but if you like, you know, mm -hmm. I like to do it this way. Add the pepper to it. You know, it depends. You know, I don't want it to make it too hot. This is cayenne pepper. Mm -hmm. So and then stir it a little bit with it. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's okay. That's perfect. Then the tomato that's been boiling, you mm -hmm. remember that? Mm -hmm. Now it's you know it's good. It feels you know you can't smell the acid smell anymore. So what you do then? Stick and then scoop it into this. Like I said earlier, it doesn't matter if you put the pepper in this one here or or the way we did it. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter. This is so good. Put it aside. You can, you can rinse it later on and add the water to it. Good. See and share it. See it now? See the color? Mm -hmm. Good. So then uh other things you can do is that if you like a little bit of the, you can add some of the shrimp just a little bit of shrimp mm -hmm. just to give it a flavor mm -hmm. so you add the shrimp see it boom now what is everything and then you continue boiling for how many minutes for for next uh, let me see it, it all depends on the texture of the meat because the meat is still cooking too while all this is going mm -hmm. so you make sure that if you want it tender it all depends on how you want your 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 your, your it's already cooked Mm -hmm. You know, but now if you want it to be tender, to be this, and you cook it for a longer time, mm -hmm. but it doesn't, you know, it doesn't, it's not going to harm you or anything. Okay. Then you let it cook for about another seven minutes. Mm 